Come show him. We picked our first lime from the lime tree. Wow. Go show him. There's actually like a million limes out there. Did but you get a lime? Is that good? Good morning. Hi babies. Don't mind this awful don't mess. Don't look at it. Just look, look at, at just look at the cuteness over it. here. Just it's look at these cuties. Kind of interesting mood. She's a little stressed out, I think. I don't think it's even I don't know. She's just like got this terrible yeah. diaper rash. Yeah, it's been pretty bad the last couple of days. Yeah, I think it's hurting her. I'm if sorry, you guys have any recommendations I'm so for sorry. what is it? Like a better oh. we've been using the honest yeah. company rash cream yeah. and it helps. But it's still like really like, I don't know what call them, like hot spots. That's what they look yeah, like. Yeah, the little spots that don't go away. And so I think that might be contributing. Hi, to honey. I'm sorry. You're not feeling good. I know. I'm so sorry. Oh, look, the sun came out. It is nice because it's been cloudy, but I like the clouds. I know you don't. I know you hate the clouds, I like but bright. I can't wait for fall when the clouds are all. Oh, sorry, you guys can't see because we have our pergola. We actually have some stuff to do this morning. We have to go back to the house. The internet company was supposed to come yesterday, but I guess there was some miscommunication on their end to where they thought they were coming on Tuesday. Um, so we are going to be hopping back and forth between the old house and this house to do internet stuff. I have some homework to do. Rochelle has to upload the vlog. I edited it. I just and have to yeah, upload so, it. So we're going to go here in just a minute and then we got to feed Mr. Because we're going to bring him over today. We want to give we want to give Bo a night here to himself and Mr. a night to himself. He did just really to chill. good. He did. He slept <coughs> he the whole did good. night. Emma slept the whole night. I thought she was going to yeah, be up all good. night, but she slept the whole night. She just woke yeah. up a little early because we don't have our blackout curtains in yeah. yet. Is she? loves being outside I know, like she loves if she's this ever in her. a bad mood i take, take her, her outside. outside anywhere here the old house she's anywhere. looking at her shadow we're here get out of her shadow she's looking at it what is that <laughs> <laughs> it's following you we're it follows be, you little baby we're go out in our pajamas today yeah we're don't we're care. all in our pjs i don't even care <laughs> he's so happy to have so much space to run i can't wait till there's grass for him to enjoy oh 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 <laughs> There he goes. He's gone. Oh, here's this. There's a dog next door that's playing with their squeaky toy. Yeah, and, and he wants he to wants play with it, that one. And so he's getting distracted. He still loves his I ball. I think this though. is like a really big dog neighborhood. I think so. so I've seen a lot. I've heard a lot. <laughs> he wants to. He wants to make a friend. He just wants a friend. He wants it. <laughs> Emma found her new fun rock piles right here in the backyard. It's a good spot too, so she doesn't fall. She can like reach that one. But as you guys know, she loves just grabbing rocks and handing them to us and then grabbing more. Emma, can I have it? Emma, can I have it? Thank you. Oh, no, not this morning. You want to keep it? You want to give it to mama? No, you're just going to take it? Okay. Oh. <laughs> She's tricking you. Give me it. I'll go. I bet it. She wants to grab those rocks. Yeah, she does. The big ones. The, the fire pit. Fire pit rocks. Yeah, the lava. What are those called? Lava rocks or whatever they are. I don't know. I don't know but but Emma, you can't have those. You gotta keep your little ones. Her hand. Did you see her? Yeah, hand her hands are all from black grab from grabbing one. it. So let's wash those. Oh, let's go wash those hands. Good morning. Welcome to Starbucks, Miss Elisa. Hi, Hi Elisa. Let me get started for you. Can I get um, an order of the egg bite, chicken sausage and bacon, a sausage and cheddar biscuit, a tall java chip, and then do you guys have any iced teas that are caffeine free? Thank, Thank you so much. Thank you. Have a great day. I'm trying to drink caffeine free today just because if I am pregnant, I want to like not be drinking a lot of caffeine. And I have been doing really good about cutting it down anyways for like my kidney stone issue. So I've been trying to, when I go to Starbucks, get like drinks that don't have caffeine in them for multiple reasons. Even though I really wanted a double chocolate chip wrap. Be strong, Rochelle, be strong. <laughs> stuff when they have to give you literally a bag to carry your stuff. Hi! Were you so good while we were gone? Were you were you so good while we were gone? What a good boy. Yeah. Got Justin's and mine and breakfast because I still have no breakfast food here. Ooh, I'm so hungry. 
I got you something different. I don't know, they, it doesn't have cheese. <laughs> something chicken. Something different? I don't like cheese. They didn't have the one you wanted. Sorry. And then I got Emma something too. <gasps> Did they give me the wrong thing? Yeah. Oh no. They gave, they just put it in this, okay. Oh, yeah. No, it's supposed to be like these egg things, but they just put it in like an oatmeal thing. All right, get down. Okay, we have been making a lot of progress in the kitchen. It may not look like it because there's still a bunch of stuff all over the island, but a lot of progress. So I'm gonna show you guys kind of what we've done as far as the kitchen goes, because that's been our main like point of attack today. Well, we cleared out the whole kitchen at the whole place, which is great. So now we can finally stop this whole exactly. house. Exactly. So now we can actually start eating it here and stuff. So I'm gonna show you guys kind of where we put everything. Like I said, the island is still kind of a mess, but um, this is gonna be like our tea and coffee station, like I said. So I've got tea and coffee stuff here, and then mugs here. And then I was gonna put like water bottles and other cups up there, but I can't barely reach up here, so I think that's not gonna work. Um, I'm not sure what's gonna go down there. Up here we have stuff we don't use very often, so like party stuff, vases, all that jazz. This is gonna be our pantry, but we don't have any food in there yet. And then this is gonna be Emma's drawer, I decided. So I like this idea of her being able to be kind of self-sufficient, come grab whatever she needs. So um, obviously not yet, but as she gets older, she'll have her cups down here, her bowls, plates, spoons, everything, just at her fingertips. So if she needs something, I can tell her to go get it. <laughs> and what is this? This has just got some oven stuff, some liquor stuff, and then this is gonna have stuff that we need for the, um, What's it called? Stove top. I got that. There's just lots of stuff here on the counter still. I put pots and pans in there. Cups, more cups, and plates and everything. And then this whole space where Justin is, is still like empty. So we have so much extra storage still to fill these cabinets with. It's which so is, nice. I know, it's really, really nice. It's nice not to have everything crammed into one spot. I felt like that's how it was at the old place. It was so everything, small. We had this in this drawer and this in this drawer. Everything was like together. Yeah, so we it's have nice to spread tons of space. Yeah. And then we still have these huge cabinets under the island, which I don't think we're going to put kitchen stuff in. We'll probably use that to put stuff like for, I don't know, like not kitchen stuff, but like things we need easy access to because they're right here. Like Emma's arts and crafts stuff or whatever we'll do in the kitchen and living room, but don't need in the kitchen. So. Justin's actually getting ready to go. He is leaving for a movie today that I don't want to see, but he wants to see. So he's going with his dad to see it, the second part. He made me watch the first half and I think I had nightmares. So I'm not going to see that one. And so I'm gonna be here with Emma, but I think I'm gonna take her out because she's been in a mood, like I said, her butt hurts and I wanna just distract her. And she's just kind of overwhelmed right now with the move, my poor baby. So I just wanna get her out. I don't know, I might go back to Target because I still feel like we still need like a lot of things to get, but I'm gonna do that. I have to get out of these and I don't want to. It's not socially acceptable to wear my pajamas out at this point. It's what time is it? 12 o'clock, I've been in my pajamas since last night. Is it 12? It's 12. Oh, wow. Yeah, you gotta leave soon. So, I gotta get changed. But these are so soft, I got these at Target. I don't know if you can see them. I got these at Target last night. They've got pockets and they're comfortable, so I don't wanna get ready. Emma's still in her pajamas too. Justin's still in his pajamas, so it's been a lazy, not lazy day, just like a home day, obviously unpacking, so got a lot to do, but she's gonna wake up soon and I'm gonna take her out just to get some fresh air. Come show him. We picked our first lime from the lime tree. Wow. Go show him. Got There's actually lime? like a million limes out there. Did but you get a lime? Is that good? No, don't eat it. Show, okay. show daddy. We cleaned it. it. We cleaned it. Thank you. She thinks it's a ball, so she's just throwing mm, it. <laughs> it smells good. Mmm, it smells good. You smell it. Mmm, citrus. <laughs> I know, we picked our first lime. We've what got... Kitty oh, where's mister? Where's it's mister? Right He's just roaming around. Exploring. He's actually doing really He's good. He's like mapping out the house. He's, <laughs> He's like, actually doing really good. He didn't fluff his tail or anything. He, he did just, right when I set him down, but then he, he I like, think that's because Bo ran up to him. Yeah, but. he's been doing really good. He's just kind of looking around here. Where do you go? I'm actually gonna go out and get him a new litter box right now. Hi, I should have gotten one earlier. Justin said the movie was good, so if you're interested in seeing it. the second part of the It series. It's good. He says to go see it. I say don't. You don't need that kind of scary monster stuff hey, in your life. There are some people like me that love 
horror movies, all right? Some. Go see it if you want. If you like them, go you. But if you don't, Team Rochelle, because scary movies are scary. And Dustin makes me see them every once in a while. So when Dustin's dad was in town, I was like, yes, you can go see it with him. The oranges, okay. she wanted to take one too. Apparently the pomegranate is a yellow pomegranate tree. I don't know because they're not red. They're like, I guess yellow pomegranates are a thing, which are they good? Have you looked it I up? didn't grab one off yet, but I kind you of- guys have had them, let us know. I didn't even know they were a thing. So. Wow, making yourself at home on the counter already. Don't eat the skin, you can just play with it. Thank you. This girl is an outdoors girl. I cannot get her to come inside all day today. She's wanted to be out here on the patio and she's not even really doing anything. She's just grabbing rocks and things and bringing them to me and it's like the happiest I've seen her. She's just such an outdoors girl. I don't know where she gets that from. By the way, I hope you guys can hear me over the wind, but look how beautiful this looks at sunset. This is the first time I really looked outside at sunset and it's like the sun's going from this direction. So it just creates this beautiful glow. I can't wait to do grass. I'm gonna have this grass hill go like this so Emma can like roll down the hill. Oh, do you wanna come too? She knows she can't get off of here. One, because it's a big step, but two, because she's not wearing shoes. Say up. That's okay, you can step over that one. <laughs> Is that too big of a jump for you? You looking for the fireplace key? It's over here, she does not remember that. We actually have to order a new one because we the owner didn't leave it here. I saw him for like six bucks on Amazon, but to turn this on, we have to have that. And that would be really nice to have. So we can have a fire with marshmallows. What do you think? So tonight is actually Sunday evening, meaning that this week is our pregnancy test. And I talked about it, what was it, two days ago? The day before we moved in, about how I was feeling. And I'm just back to not knowing whether or not I'm pregnant. Like, I just, I, I literally, if I had to bet, I don't know what I would bet because there have been those moments. And, and you guys are all so convinced <laughs> that I'm pregnant, which I appreciate the positivity. Positivity, positivity every day. Um, I just don't know. Like, I honestly have no idea if I'm pregnant or not because the nausea thing is so random. It's not all the time. It was worse a couple of days ago. Now it's not really barely here at all. And so there's that. And then the exhaustion is probably just from moving because we've been moving, carrying boxes. Well, not carrying boxes, but just been on our feet and stuff. And then what's the other thing? The burping. That's just a weird thing. But um, I just don't know. We're supposed to find out this week and I just don't know what to expect. I really hope I am. I just, I don't know if I'm pregnant. I just, I, now that I'm saying that, I'm starting to feel a little nauseous. I hope that that's just, I hope that's just pregnancy nausea and not just like, it could be from a lot of things. It could be from the meds. I'm taking so many like prenatals that like upset my stomach and like every other pill. I have to take so many pills. I take prenatal, baby aspirin, estrogen, progesterone, folic or folate, just like a lot. So, and I'm starting to feel crampy and I don't know if that's normal or if it's like a period crampy. So hopefully we find out soon. I'll get you guys the answers as soon as I can. We usually take about one to two days to process the results before posting because it's pretty emotional. So that's all I'm gonna say about when we're gonna be posting them right now because I don't actually know what day we'll post the results. I, but we never make you guys wait too long. Sorry, we never make you guys wait too long from after we find out the results because we want you guys to be in the know with us. We don't delay it that much. We don't touch the lava rock, okay? Turned your hands black last time. She keeps on like leaning down on her butt, that little like squat that she's doing to look at that. Hey, hey, don't grab that lava rock. Don't grab it. There's other rocks for you to grab. Yeah, there's other rocks for you to grab. Daddy went to go get you some food, mac and cheese. I also want to say, we want to put trees all along this fence line, not like bushes like those, but like big trees to make this space more private, which I think will make it even better. Let's go inside, baby. Come on, we've been out for like an hour. <laughs>
got Emma to bed for the night. Hopefully she sleeps well. I guess Rochelle said she didn't take a really good second, or she didn't take a second nap today, which is super weird. Don't know what that's about. I know it's kind of dark in here, sorry guys. We are gonna end the vlog for the night. You look absolutely exhausted. Come on, come sit. <laughs> I'm so tired. Come on. I'm like, I'm I know. Lumpy. Oh, come me on. too, I'm so exhausted. It's been, the days have been going by quick, but I'm just like so done by the end of the night. I'm jealous. You guys know, the move, moving is fun. I'm You're jealous, jealous of what? Of you. Of me. I ain't gotta go to a movie today and sit for like two and a half hours. You're free to go see a movie whenever you want. <laughs> I'm just jealous. Go ahead. I didn't get to take, she didn't take her second nap. That so like, sucks, you didn't get I a break. I was just like, I'm sorry. dying. Well now you can go see a movie whenever you want. So. Okay. But we're gonna probably go to bed now because we're exhausted. So <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching. Yeah. And Bo is such oh, a little sweet And boy. Mister, where's Mister? He's finally getting situated here. Mister, oh, okay, Mister, he's so cute. He's like all curled oh, up he's right like there. Up against the Hi, buddy. Stuff. You're that's doing cute. so good. I'm glad that they're getting situated. You're doing so good. That's I'm proud of them. Thank you guys so much for watching. Appreciate you guys journeying with us through this. And find out if we're more, pregnant this Yeah, week. more news and projects to come this week. Sorry, it's way too close. Good job. Good night. <laughs>